you had a man that would count how many chicken nuggets you yeah. would eat? <laughs> what the fuck? Call her daddy. I had an ex tell me that I couldn't wear sweatpants. Sorry, what? He yeah. would f***ing hate me. <laughs> Holy sh**. And then after two weeks when I was like better with my therapy on, the, on point, and I was like, what the f*** I was doing with that guy? He kisses terribly. His kiss? Bleh. What is the most cringe thing a guy has ever done to get your attention? Mm, they put their wiener in the popcorn box. Sorry. <laughs> What I can't f***ing stand is when a guy will plant bread crumb, breadcrumbs. I dated a guy who would come to Nashville and he would like tag the location. And I'm like, why? You've never tagged a location in your life. Why now are you you're... now? That shit I can't stand. Because it's so purposeful. After we, after we had sex for the first time in my then 315 square foot apartment, he said this does not look like the apartment of someone on a hit show. Well, the nightclub came about because I was dating someone whose passion was to open a nightclub. Okay. So he asked me for money and I was like, okay, <laughs> that's like what happened. I'm 63. You look back and you go, there were very few, few situations where people had their had all their shit together